previously on a Pinoy's journey in transit. Moscow, hero city in the capital of Russia. It is a riddle wrapped in a mystery inside an enigma. It's May 10 and I'm looking for my new hostel. We're here in Arbat Street. So from what I can see here in our map, I think our hostel is on the other side of the road let's find out if this is the hotel come on let's go in we're finally here look we got a hostel so my friends this is the place where, I, where i'll be staying tonight back back so this is the only money i've got for now and Let's go find a bank and exchange our currency. So it's my 11 and I'm waiting for a train going to uh, going to the station for the train to St. Petersburg. I'm not quite sure but I think this is the train station going to St. Petersburg. Since we'll be staying in Russia for a while, I decided to explore 640 kilometers northwest outside of Moscow. May 11th. I just arrived here in St. Petersburg. Petersburg. Uh, the first thing to do is find our hostel. So finally found my hotel. It's crazy. Look, no wonder they call it a hostel. Let's go in. So it's Friday, May 12th, and I'm here in St. Petersburg. And this is the Aqua Hostel. And it's supposed to be shared rooms, but I'm the only one here. Look, it's empty. It's my bed. This is my friend Kate, and she's helping me. Hello! Uh, get around St. Petersburg. Thank you, Kate. <laughs> Searching for a bus, a bus station. I'm here at Octobo, Octobo bus station. I don't want a bus right now and I have no idea who it is. This bus is going to Peter Hobbs, but some guy he just pushed me and get in the bus. This is going to Peter Hobbs. I can't believe it. We have about three hours to get to get here. Three? The year was 1916. Nicholas was the Tsar of Imperial Russia. Welcome to Peterhof Palace, the Versailles of Russia. Located in the suburb of St. Petersburg, Northwestern European Russia, on the southern shore of the Gulf of Finland. It all started here, the tale that morphed into a modern myth. place is so big I don't I don't think it would be possible to explore the entire area in one day bigger than my hometown I think I will always remember this place as the Anastasia Palace even if the 1997 animated movie was not entirely accurate she was born here in 1901 the most lavish and popular of the Tsar residences. It's time for a 
us to find the bus station and go back to Sto Sportive Naya. I don't know if I pronounce it correctly, the street or the station where I'm living. So many things to do, so little time, but I guess time for us to go home because tonight I'm meeting with some familiar faces. Next on, a finished journey in transit.